Sunfrog here and today we're going to be covering Facebook's new custom audience tracking. So Facebook pretty recently just announced that they have some changes coming and it was to the uh, to your custom audiences and they actually now have uh, custom audience tracking similar to like what Google Analytics has going on. So basically they broke it down into nine different events that can be tracked separately um, and it required some pretty intensive coding, as you can see here. And anyone that has tried to do this before can attest. Um, you can actually see a lot of people here saying that it's impossible. However, it is not. And we have finished it, and it is now ready to go. So to get started, we're going to head over to our Ads Manager. For those of you that haven't seen it, this is what the new Ads Manager looks like. It's pretty mo a lot more extensive than uh, kind of the old system was. You can see all the stuff up top here. We got the Power Editor still there. Uh, all these options going on and the one we're most uh, concerned with is going to be the pixel. So here you can see a graph tracking all of your pixel activity. Basically just showing you all the traffic you had on any of the audiences that you've created. This is broken down into URLs they've came in on, uh, the domains that they, you know they're associated with, and even the devices that your users came in on. And now you see this tab on the end, events, and this is what Facebook is talking about. This is what they just recently implemented. Um, in order to get this set up, you'll see uh, your pixel ID here. You just want a copy of that, and that's what we'll take over to our manager page. Over on the dashboard, where we'll want to go to find this, is to Facebook retargeting. So for those of you that have already been doing Facebook retargeting, you already have this in place, and this should have already been tracking for you. There's nothing you're going to need to do. But for anybody that wasn't doing uh, Facebook retargeting in the past. You just grab that number that we took from Facebook and you just plug it in here and hit save. And then it's ready to go. That's all there is to it. And now if we head back on over to our Ads Manager and click on the Event tab, you'll see all the new fields that we've added for you guys. So we kind of added the, uh, the most three pertinent ones to affiliate marketing, which is going to be view content, which anybody coming in uh, to your product page, you're going to get a ping here for that. Initiate checkout, so anybody that adds to cart and actually gets to the checkout, um, you're going to see a ping for that. And then the purchase, anybody that actually gets to the thank you page and have a confirmed purchase, you're going to see that in here as well. Uh, you also see page view. We noticed that wasn't that much different than view content, so we actually killed that uh, in our testing. So that information alone is really useful, but we can actually take this another step further and decide to create an audience off of this information, effectively creating sub-audiences. So if you've created an audience before, you're going to be familiar with this page. Um, but what's really cool is now instead of plugging in a URL to create our custom audience, we can actually create an audience based on an event. So we can create an audience of people that have come in and viewed our product pages. And we could add a condition to also include people that have got to the initiate checkout. And we can even add exclusions. We could exclude people that have gotten that have purchased. So we can target only people that haven't purchased in the past. And you know, those are just a couple examples. Uh, there, there's a lot of different uh, ways you can add these things together and create a, some really customized audiences. Uh, this is a really powerful new feature that Facebook has rolled out, and uh, the, our side of it was released uh, just yesterday. So we've been using it, and we look forward to seeing how you guys like it, and hope you see good results with it. Thank you.